Can I get a resounding woo? Mm -hmm. Woo hoo! Why? <laughs> We're currently packing our bags for PEI and it's like the most casual pack that I've ever done or at least in the last like little while it's the most casual pack because it's just a little bit of this a little bit of that and we don't really have to worry <sighs> ignore the mess back there we're still trying to sort everything in this room but yay we're gonna go in a couple of hours probably well I don't even know probably an hour or so whenever um, whenever Rob gets home from work <laughs> It's amazing here. We've got all this land to run around on, which we're not going to run around on, but it's really awesome. Um, that back there, I don't know if you can see it, it's the ocean, which is awesome. Um, for anyone who doesn't know, PEI is Prince Edward Island, which is a province in Canada. I think it's the smallest province in Canada. And it's just super, like, super quiet and maritime here, um, even more so than like New Brunswick than St. John. Um, so I like it though. It's a different sort of lifestyle than what I'm used to, but I just, I, I just love everything about this place. I mean, I haven't been since I was a young, like small child, but I just have such fond memories of it. And I definitely want to make it a habit of coming out here um, and seeing this place more. The houses are just gorgeous. Everything is just gorgeous. The fact that I can see the ocean like freaking a, half a mile away from me, probably less than that, is amazing. What I really want to do is go to see Green Gables because I'm obsessed with Anne of Green Gables. And as I mentioned before, I we watched the entire miniseries in preparation for this trip. So, so yeah. Hopefully we actually get to go do that. It should be free because we have the, the Canada 150 pass that well, my parents do in their car. So we shall see. <laughs> we'll see what happens and hopefully everything turns out good. My entire like life has led up to this moment. It's a little bit better than when I was younger and don't really have the best memories, but yay! I'm in! Well, oh, my bangs are messed up. I'm in the Green Gables! I'm really cold, you can see by my nose. I'd make a good ginger, I think.
when I was really young and we were here. Um, there was like squirrels and they'd come up right to you. That's like one of the really vivid memories that I have of like coming to Prince Edward Island when I was younger is just the squirrels in this like park coming up to us and not running away. And I love squirrels. They're so cute. Maybe that's why I love squirrels so much. What do you think? Oh, for sure. Because <laughs> it's just like, they just, oh, they're so cute. The little baby squirrels would come up to us and I just love them. This is awesome. I'm so excited. I got some raspberry cordial, which if anybody has read Anna Green Gables or seen the, the films or the miniseries, then you know the significance of the raspberry cordial. I don't think I'm gonna open it. I gotta warm someone so that it doesn't sweat and ruin the label. So I'm pretty excited about that. It was expensive though. It was like almost $4. Well, no, it was just over $3. Not a big deal. But we're gonna go into the gift shop because I love gift shops. Probably won't buy anything else because I got that. And yeah, this is just, I'm just so excited. I'm just so happy. I've had such a great day. This is Avonlea Village, which is where um, Anne of Green Gables takes place, basically. So, so technically the village is closed off, but the lady in the shop told us, uh, like it's closed for the season, but the lady in the shop told us that we could be really sneaky and just jump the fence or walk around. And we're gonna jump the fence because we're, we're brave, aren't we? But if you walk around the fence, This is gonna be fun. Yay, I did it! <laughs> You're gonna walk around? They're gonna walk around. the greatest thing ever. I'm really excited right now. I'm having a wonderful trip so far. I've got, I've got my Canada hat on. It's not mine at all. It's my boyfriend's. And I've got my University of Glasgow sweater on, which is mine. It's not his. Um, I didn't go there, but he did, but I didn't, and I got a sweater. Um, yeah, no. Oh, this is my childhood dreams come true. Hi! We're walking the dog down to the beach, which is that way. I honestly feel like I'm in like the set of like a really like rural movie or TV show. I like it. I should go back there and see if they're okay. at least for the trailer and this beautiful, gorgeous view. Um, we're going to do a few things today before we hit the road to go home. It's, it's very windy, but, uh, but yeah, we'll see a few things and then we're going to go home, go over the bridge in the day, hopefully, so that we can see it. Um, yeah. We're here at the Bottle House. 
does is, and after a bit of confusion, we figured out they are actually open. They're open until the 5th of October, which we figured they were. Um, but yeah, so it looks really cool. So the dog can come as long as we carry him. That is good. He is not a giant dog. That is good. We're going to go see some houses that are made out of pop bottles, glass bottles, <laughs> pop bottles. And it does look absolutely amazing, doesn't it? Yes. Yes. Legitimately just like, just the gardens are gorgeous. It's worth it. Oh, we're gonna go inside. <sighs> it does, I've seen that. Look at it in here. It's so gorgeous. It's, it's amazing. Off of that. Ew, no, actually, it doesn't look that appetizing, but so cool. Honestly, such a sur serene place. Like, I feel like happy and pleased here. It's just beautiful, and you get the view of the ocean, which is really nice, as I already said. But just like, just the idea of the whole like sustainability of the houses being made out of glass, like glass bottles and cement. They're so bright inside. It's just very, it's very nice. Oh, the paths are even made out of like bottles. You can see, it's just, it's lovely. bottle houses. We're about to head towards the bridge, um, see what we can find on the way, see what we do. This should be fun. We're just out of the car walking around and 
around seeing some stuff. Hopefully we can get, hopefully, well, I don't know what I just said. Hopefully we can get some lunch because it's getting a little bit hungry and it's like a distance. We're like three hours away from home. So get some food before we go. It's very windy here as well because we're right by the water. Everything is closed. I guess we're gonna just try to find some food over on the other side of the bridge. It's so windy. Um, but yeah, so um, I suppose that's where I'm gonna end this. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to subscribe to see more, I would definitely suggest doing that. You can hit the subscribe button, uh, leave a comment, ask questions, just say whatever you want to say. I'm, I will always answer. Um, but yeah. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye! Do something cute. Wow. Joy, you spent a lot of money for one. Hey, cute boy, do something cute. Not just look at